honestly a step up from last week. Like, it was slightly better. I would say it had some more feels towards the end of the episode when she realised she had, like, kind of leave the world that she wants to be in to be in the real world, to basically accept her family rather than not go to this family where she does... I guess she doesn't really belong. And again, I've seen this done before, and I've seen it done better. But I think it's just Kyoto Annie's charm that it kind of maybe like it a little a little bit more than I should have done. Even if the characters are borderline retarded sometimes, like there were times when I was just like, come on, don't. I mean when Rue just gave uh, Mai the actual food, I was just like Really? I was kinda of like No, you don't do that. And then Haruko just ate it, I was like I was like, you don't do that, man. It's kind of like you don't go into a different world and start eating the food. It's against the freaking law. You just don't do it. It's like, it's like bro tip number one. You just don't eat the food. Like, it's just, you don't. But, I guess. What can you do? Basically, yeah. So the whole episode just centered on Reina. This whole episode basically was her. It was just, it was depressing the fact that it was basically just looking at the life that she lives, like she look, like the personal life that she lives. Because up to this point, we don't really know much about her. So we kind of like we learn more about her family. She has a kind of family that's not really accepted of um, phantoms, and her being kind of this person that cunts down the phantoms. So they're kind of like, nah, mate, you can't be doing that, okay? Fam, all right, sit down. You can't be doing this. And then they kind of, she's kind of like, well, guess what? F you all. And then she goes to a different world and basically she lives in a world full of bunny rabbits and um, rice. And yeah, it was depressing for that fact. I would say I kind of liked this episode a lot more because it was kind of it was kind of genuine storytelling and it kind of did it pretty damn well. Like it didn't, it, yeah, the characters were still borderline stupid and it kind of got a bit annoying after a while. But the actual world itself it created, it actually, it actually made me realise this anime is going somewhere. And it's, even though it did, it did basically take it to Kyoto Wani land, but still, it was a nice world, and the aesthetic style to it basically lended itself well to it. Like, the aesthetic style was the best bit of the whole episode, in my opinion. But besides the actual bunny rabbits, kind of representing something that's cute, and kind of kind of welcoming, and kind of, like, loving. I kind of like that idea. These kind of like animals just, just show a, a loving kind of idea, because, again, you an animal is always it represented as love. In a kind of this kind of thing, how I see it as an animal, which is like, you sort of know it's a loving kind of thing. But yeah, I mean, it was pretty damn depressing. And my basically then eating the food as well. <laughs> I was when my just ate the food. I was like, come on, really? But yeah, I mean, it's it it's just. I think it needs to. I think it needs its time. Just Kyoto Man needs, needs to sit down and go, guys. We've got to stop touching the boobs, okay? We can't be touching the boobs constantly. Just. You need to calm down with that and then make an actual genuine anime because the anime could be really freaking good. But it's just, it's, it's heavily dumbed down by the tropes it's using. I think that's why I'm not liking it as much as I should be liking it. I still like it, it's good, but it's not as good as, say, any other anime I've made before. It ain't no just Prince of Hyrule is a mere. That's a goddamn sure. Like, it's been better. They should be doing better. But unless we got some more uh, Kyoto next week, if I'm pronouncing the name right. Kyoto. But yeah, so that was Myriad, basically, in a nutshell. With all that said, I have been the driver. I'm gonna leave. If you wanna leave a like, if I can say my words properly, leave a like. Some kind of leave a sub. Do leave a sub. It doesn't come up. With all that said, I have been the driver. And I'll see you guys later. Bye for now.